Hey guys, Trifka Johnny here today with a word back with Fruit Basket episode 2. Uh, I have um, a new light coming on Monday, so mine will be a bit weird, but hopefully this will do. Last episode was really good actually, to be fair. I think the animation art style held up. I thought it was really decent. I like. The, I actually preferred the designs in this to the older series. Just a quick note, if you didn't if you didn't watch episode 1, I have watched the first two episodes of the original Fruit Basket. But I've watched no more. If you want a more of an in-depth explanation about that, just watch the episode 1 reaction. But, yeah, this will be my last episode where I know of anything that happens. And then after that, it's all new to me. But yeah, overall, I thought it introduced characters pretty well. We've got a nice motivation and character visualization for the main girl. And, yeah, we got to know about the whole animal when she hooks people to the turn to animals. Which is obviously going to be a big thing of the series. Which gives it a bit more of a unique spin on it. And it's just a enjoyable ride as it is a romance. And so do I'm interested to see where, who it's going to get with and what ships there is. Like I said, in my first episode, my ship, even though I only watched two episodes, I really like the ginger guy. He seemed pretty cool. Is it Keo? I'll learn names as we we'll keep watching. So yeah, obviously that's going to change for out of the whole series and I can't wait to see how it's going to unfold. And obviously by the ending there's quite a lot of characters I've never seen before so I'm interested to see them as well. Just wait to find out so we'll watch their next episode. So please like and subscribe if you enjoy. Check out the episode of Reaction because I had a lot of fun with it. And then I'm doing the other spring season animation you want to check those out. Do another romance which is um, Can't Hear That Sound, Coral and Tuesday. If you enjoy this you probably enjoy those two as well. So feel free to check that out. And now let's get into this. Random conditions to transform. Oh, what do you guys think of the intro to that? I was a bit. Hmm, I don't know. The visuals weren't great. The song was okay. It's a bit of a shame. Oh, opinion changed. Triggered. His fucking eyes. Mate, a bit far. Poor table. Oh shit. When Tsunori goes too far. <laughs> you can tell. Man feels bad. Fucking bitch slapped. <laughs> when it turned into. What do you mean? It's no longer a show, a show Joe, it's a show in. <laughs> no, 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 not the door. Ooh, don't judge him. Okay. I actually forgot about that detail, to be fair. Um, that makes make sense. At least then it makes more sense why they've stayed hidden for so long. I actually totally forgot that was a thing. They could wipe people's memories. Ooh, that could be a pop point for later they could go into. <laughs> I don't know what she'd silly go, what the fuck? Told me not that guy glam obviously respectable, I like it. <laughs> Dramatic hang slam. Tell the uh, past incidents is a uh, wave upon him. Oh, here we go. Oh, who's that? That'll probably experiment on you, mate. Fucking hell, Tra talk about traumatising a kid. For fuck's sake. Well, this secret's not going to stop soon, is it? <laughs> Imagine walking back in when he turned into a human again. God, the rumours. And he falls for her. Now we just need Keo's moment to fall for her. And then the ship wars begin. <clears throat> that's when sh that's when shoujo animes get really intense. I mean, it would have been nice to experience the community back then when it was first happening. 
Sex tape. An apology. It's coming. I feel it. He is a true tsunade. It's beautiful. I don't think I've come across many guy tsunades in anime. They're not a very common one. I've not listened to the dub yet, but I'm surprised the dub's already out for this, if you're interested, guys. I was quite amazed. It came out fast. <laughs> I haven't read the forms of episode one yet, so I don't know what actual people's opinion of this show is. I wonder if there's a bit of an argument going on. You know how people get when they're doing remakes. Why a secret toilet? Oh, even more character interactions. Yes. <laughs> mate, a bit ice cold. Why the hatred, mate? Oh, poor cat. That cat did get fucking wrecked, though. It was a bit unfair. No, we can't express his feelings at this moment. Oh yeah, I forget. Like in Japan, that would be really odd, wouldn't it, Orange here? <laughs> I love how different he is. I don't remember any of this. Even though I don't know if it's following the old anime scene by scene. Fuck, did he just say that was close? Fucking hell. He just fucking, fucking took her down. Uh. I know, that is a bit risky. I guess if he's been to an old boy as well, I wouldn't have been have much used to it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Mate, I had to make someone feel bad. Ooh, oh, he, the deep wounds. I love how the dogs the wise one of the group. I love how this is the anime take on Tom and Jerry. Mate, this guy with the wise words. And that's what will break the, the sessions. There is one in the house. A bit too soon for that. We need a, need a bit more development. No, it's fucking Rat Boy. Oh, no, it's Keo. Oh, shit. Boy came to apologise and he just got hit. <laughs> Oh man, trying to control the anger. Come on, you can do it, boy. This guy, all a bit shy. It's glorious. What weird feelings. <laughs> Wanting to be the cat zodiac. Yes. She threw the friend word out there, I'm ready.
He will be best boy of the season. I can tell. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> Overall, fun episode. Um, I would like to adapt. I think we've got to know a bit more about both the lads now. Um, a lot more about Kyo this episode and a bit more about the other lad. But yeah, um, he did the most snotty apology ever. Otherwise, I enjoy his character. His character seemed pretty cool and look forward to see where they're going to go with her from here with him. And yeah, we've got the whole like, household stable now. We've got a bit more of like, the brainwashing. I forgot about that, to be fair. And from now on, I don't have a clue what's going to happen. To be fair, I don't even remember any of that episode, so I'm guessing they did change some stuff from the original. I heard this one's following the manga closer, so I didn't, I'm not actually that sure about anything from now on, so that's going to be pretty interesting. I don't even know who the end couple is, to be fair. Uh, and if they actually introduce more guys, to be fair. Um, other than that, no, enjoy the episode. I like here, that episode. Uh, don't have a ship yet, obviously, obviously it's only just started. Um, I don't want to get to know them both a bit more. And then other than that, yeah, I like Toro, she's a pretty cool character. And I like the dog guy, he's pretty neat. He's, he's wise, but he is a dog. But yeah, thanks for watching the episode with me, guys. Sorry about the lighting. I'm sure I'll get it fixed later. Uh, on about Monday-ish, Monday, Wednesday. So by next episode, it should be sorted. And I'll see you next week. Peace.